And now will people around here are very loving, and trusting, and generous, you know, with what they have. They're, uh, it's, just, it's just really an honor to be in their midst and, and you know, working with, with, with them. Over the uh, hundred years or plus that we've been among them, we have studied their culture and their language and their ceremonies and their religion. And uh, it, it dovetails very beautifully with Christianity. I think their main purpose, their main philosophy is uh, like hospitality. It's the same as, as, as feeding and clothing. You know, visiting the sick and visiting the prisoners, and you know they have the same philosophy as, as the Sermon on the Mount, actually, mm -hmm. even before they heard the Sermon on the Mount. So their philosophy fits right right in with Christianity and details of uh, Jesus Christ and Mary and all those things. They just all fit in real well. That's all. We use uh, the, what is precious with them is, is their. Uh, pottery chalices and pottery instruments for the altar. You know, in other churches in the, say in Albuquerque, they would be using silver and gold, but pottery is just as precious as silver and gold out here. I think. And it has all the symbols of, of their culture. On it. We don't deal with large numbers of people as they do in, in say, city parishes. It's handfuls of people you know, I'm just as happy to deal with handfuls of people as I am with thousands of, you know, yeah. mega church or whatever. I wouldn't trade. I wouldn't trade the Vatican for this little church, honestly. Mm -hmm.